Small children crossing into the U.S. in many cases alone without their parents and then getting trapped in limbo. These images obtained by ABC News revealing people sleeping on what looks like foil. Tonight, just one snapshot of what some are calling now an urgent humanitarian problem. ABC's senior national correspondent Jim Avila with exclusive new video tonight raising new questions about a hidden America just now discovered. It is a huge humanitarian crisis on the border right now. A gigantic, unprecedented surge of minors, most without parents or guardians, crossing our southern border on their own by the thousands. Captured by the Border Patrol, as seen in these photos taken within the last two weeks, and provided to ABC News by Texas Congressman Henry Cuellar. They show the teens and younger children packed into fence cages and on hard floors. Advocacy groups today formally complaining to the Department of Homeland Security that 80% of the children had inadequate food and water supplies. Pastor John Torres has been inside the Nogales, Arizona Border Patrol facility. It's gruesome. I don't even know how to explain. I'm a little appalled at uh, seeing this, the way they're holding, like they're prisoners. They're not prisoners, children. The children are supposed to be transferred within 72 hours to the Department of Health and Human Services and a more humane setting as seen in this exclusive video taken by a government camera just last week and released today to ABC News. A first look at where the children spend their time, cafeterias, classrooms, where English is taught, and gym classes. A far different scene than these children's first stop in American custody. Undeniably. There is a problem of humanitarian proportions in the Rio Grande Valley sector that we must deal with. Most of the kids crossing the border illegally, this is the Rio Grande, are not from Mexico over there. They're from Central America and are often fleeing violent crime. The number one point of origin is Honduras, called the murder capital of the world, coming here into the open and overwhelmed arms of the U.S. Border Patrol. David. Jim Avila tonight. Jim, thank you. And of course, our Hidden America team will stay on this in the weeks and months to come right here on World News.